his last three actual matches he, he lost them by the odd frame so he, he's under a little bit of pressure he's done not that much by his standards since lifting the champion of champions title early in the season well the safety error early from robertson could prove costly this is a good early chance for Allen to get something substantial on the board. No. Yeah, one of the, uh, the, the real cream of the, the crop and the, the tour, isn't it? And you can sort of tell here, can you? Even just with the first few little shots, it, it doesn't look any different from what he does in a regular tour match you know he's not rushing round the table normal pace not a problem he gets great work out of that cue ball as well and look at that effortless nice and tight in behind the red 24 let's pick his spot off this next color that red doesn't go to left corner though does it so that presents a problem must get a good angle He could scarcely have played any better in winning that 25. Champion of Champions event. Beat Ronnie O'Sullivan in the quarters, the world champion. The runaway world number one, Judd Trump, in the semis. And then the reigning UK champion, Neil Robertson, in the final. He was just irresistible that week. He's gone into the pack, and it looks like he's on a red. 32. Yeah, Folsey called a shot earlier this afternoon, then is the shot of the afternoon. That, for me is up there as well, just to push a few reds into the open, just caress them open. Really. You're able to do that on again on this type of cloth, it's that slick and responsive, you just get it in and get double spin or triple spin out of that cue ball, just get them separated, just like that. And this cue ball here, I know we always go on about it, it has been absolutely top drawer, every shot has been on the button. Thirty nine. Forty four. Well, this could be a big one, couldn't 45. it? We've only had 21 centuries in the decade-long history of this event. But the way he's going. Every chance of making something 52. really substantial here. Certainly putting the match to bed at this visit. Yeah, and even there is Cupol. That water shot that was, wasn't it, to land on that red? Yeah, four and a half minutes in, he's on 60 already, so uh, mopping these up with a minimum of fuss now, Mark Allen. And I think you're right, Phil, we could be on for a big ton here. 60. The highest ever was by Tepchara Nu when he won the title two years ago, 139. Shot clock now in operation. Well, he only needs one more red to make the frame safe. What a break this has been! Yeah, stunning, absolutely stunning. Just they've never lost the cue ball once, it's just been perfect. There's another example of it. He's, you know, he's knows if he's too high, he's got the one, the loose one, the middle of the five. Just everything's been pinpoint accurate. There it is, the, the middle red of the five, absolutely plumb on it, tight in behind the black. It's been 77. exemplary. I know we, I think the viewers, everyone watching this tournament, always think, what, who's on my short list? Who do I fancy? Who would I have a little, you know, flutter on to maybe go deep? You know that this guy is on everybody's list. Yes, he's a big hitter. He's Ranked high, but 
the way he plays and there's everything about him that suits this Thank format. You. Well, there's still 51 available here, so he could set a new record in shootout history for the biggest ever break. And the way he's queuing, you wouldn't put it against him by any means. It's so good to watch, isn't he, Mark Allen? That cue ball control pinpoint. Wonderful break. Yeah, like, yeah. Yeah, like I was saying, you know, right from the start, the first couple of shots, you got that sense, didn't you? And, you know, how can you have a match that lasts 10 minutes or one frame and you look this good? I mean, that is, this has just been mesmerising stuff. Jimmy Robertson played a safety, got it wrong, left Allen at the sharp end of the table. And this is the result. Talk about clinical, magnificent break. 115. Yes, enjoy your dinner, James. <laughs> He's just had to stand there and watch this. You know, it happens, though. It happens. So a possible 142 total clearance here from Mark Allen. What a way to start the tournament for him. 24. No crowds this year at the shootout, but we've already had some high drama. We've had nail-biting finishes. We've had Sam Craigie nearly blowing it, but coming through on a shootout blue. And we've just had the highest break in shootout history from Mark Allen, a magnificent total clearance of 142, just the 22nd century in shootout history.